hey guys welcome back to another video uh so guys in this video i am going to show you guys the teams that i love to play with in the arena and teams that actually help me to do and to do more damage in the arena plus uh you know get me more points on the leaderboard you're also going to take a look at the artifacts normally when i upload videos on my arena fights i don't really uh you know uh, show you guys artifacts at times so but in this video i'm going to show you the artifacts i'm going to tell you how exactly these artifacts are going to make a difference uh, with that team and how exactly we're going to defeat uh, teams with high threats with difficult characters all right guys so the first team that we have is uh, the justice league team again uh cyborg justice league cyborg is an important part of this team if you don't have cyborg then uh you know you may not be uh, you will definitely not be able to do the damage that you will see right now so make sure that you get cyborg it's it may be a little difficult but you know we get the invasions uh for him and open the justice league chest so let's begin so the artifacts are as follows twin blade uh and then we got region matrix and then at the end we got a dark metal cards and aquaman now the reason why i use twin blade over here uh is actually because uh you know we can do first thing is we can do armor piercing attacks second thing is that those armor piercing basic and swipe attacks can actually ta uh, deal damage to tagged out teammates you see you see that there was a little bit of health already taken out of the other two characters which tagged in you know and moving on moving on to the next battle this will be a good one because these are all legendaries you can literally finish the battles within seconds we'll also fight dark side uh because the reason i'm going to show you the fight with dark side is because uh you know he he died over there unfortunately i was trying to combo interrupt but still as you can see even aquaman can uh, deal a lot of damage now the other good thing about twin blade is that he that particular artifact can help you to remove any sort of shield or barriers that the opponent is having so this is why uh you know you need to put on this artifact to good use in the arena i'll take a look at the shield the barrier and it's gone it, it doesn't even stay for a microsecond i guess you see it's there for one minute and then it's gone the other second it's there a second and it's gone all right guys now moving on next team so the next team that i love to play with is the loa team now you know if you're wondering which artifacts do i usually go with uh, on this particular team so again i have a twin blade on uh, last law of the joker a twin blade on last law of the joker i got dark metal cards on heartbreaker harley quinn and a region matrix on epi Again, this team will help you to do a hell lot of damage with this with these artifacts. And they are again not that difficult to obtain. It may be a bit difficult to get the gears, but yeah, we do have that particular chest uh for gears. And as you can see, we are doing damage to tagged out teammates as well. Oh no. So this is one of those teams that I love to play with. Plus joker can blind the opponent with a special two epi can heal your team all right that's she's blinded never mind we got some help for joker over there now we can do a little loop over here with the special two and she's dead and he's dead too so this is again another team that i love to play with you know you get pretty easy victories whatever team you're fighting it doesn't matter uh you can fight dark side if you have twin blade you can fight i just fought the uh, batman ninja team i wouldn't really suggest for you guys fighting batman ninja team if you're a complete beginner or like started playing this game or like an intermediate player as well because batman ninja team will kill you in seconds so avoid them if you're a beginner or an intermediate player but if you have like these artifacts you can still go ahead and take them down there we go nice he regenerated obviously he's king king of atlantis aquaman otherwise this fight was done in like four five seconds it is now over in 11 seconds okay all right guys so uh now the next team we got the all blades yeah, we got the all blades on uh multiverse armored supergirl i got uh dark metal cards on uh flash and i have a 
clause of chaos clause of chaos is an azure artifact what it can do well it can give you flat increase in damage i think around 75 80 percent and it also stuns the opponent on basic on swipe attacks let's see so i i only use all blades on this team and you will see uh on just uh, as you can see this is clause of forest and uh, there is the all blades obviously on uh, Multiverse Armored Supergirl. This is the only team where I use the Orb Blades. Sometimes I use it on uh, when I'm using some legendary characters, you know, over there. But normally I only use Dark Metal cards or I just go with a Twin Blade. All Blades is a thing of a past. And it kind of comes in handy at times in uh, Arena, but not that much in Rage. There we go. So you can either switch with Multiverse Green Arrow or you can try to go with Multiverse Supergirl too if you are looking for more, uh, you know, or looking to make your team a little bit more tanky, you know, to take more damage. I use this because he allows our character, our team like Flash and Supergirl to uh, power steal on special one, or power drain on special one. All right, nice. This is dead. So these are these are not that strong characters, to be honest. Uh, but yeah, you know, this team can again help you win fights in a matter of seconds. There we go. I hope there is no region matrix. There isn't. All right, guys, next team, Batman Ninja team, Batman Ninja Catwoman with Dark Metal cards, Robin with Region Matrix, and I don't have any gears or artifacts on Grodd. I could I could try putting something over there, but I'm pretty sure, 100% sure I'm not going to use him in the fight until and unless it's like he's like the last man standing over there. All right, so the few good things about this team is that a special two can regenerate, there is immortality, uh, you know, the combo meter is high thanks to Robin. Uh, you know, and uh, plus, you just have to be uh, careful a little bit over here because they do tend to take a lot of damage from good damage dealers. Right, so this again, if you, you play this team right, you can finish the fights in seconds again. That's why I love that. And most of the teams that I showed you, almost all of the teams I think I currently showed you are gold, gold characters. All right, you see, uh, that's the difference that Immortality Passive can make. Yeah, I, I kind of tend to use a special too much often, you know. And the reason behind that is the regeneration thing. You can use special one as well or special three if you want to, but I, I prefer using a special two. As you can see, she is regenerating a lot. And that was a great hit. So that was fight that was done in 30 seconds. Now, if, yeah, there is one more thing. If you're fighting against someone uh, if you're fighting against raven you just have to make sure that you don't uh, let raven do a darkness on you because that darkness tax will remove that passive for immortality and you will die all right guys so this is just going too fast let's slow it down a bit all right guys so the next team and the last team is raiden now this team i'm stopping it over here i there are many other legendary characters that i can show you uh, but most of the players out there, they might not have those legendary characters. They might not have the gears on those legendary characters. Right. Okay. So, Raiden. I, I, I recently uploaded a video on Raiden. So, this is the exact team that I used. But this is actually now one of my new favorite teams that I use in the arena. Again, Twin Blade, Dark Metal Cards, and Region Matrix. Uh, Twin Blade on Raiden, Dark Metal Cards on Shazam, and Region Matrix on Nightmare Batman. And plus, uh, the reason why I put in Nightmare Batman is uh, to make things a little easier. Initially, he stuns the opponent until and unless they're having like a very high stun resistance, which allows Raiden in turn to do a huge amount of damage just in the beginning. Again, again, a Batman Ninja team. Perfect example. But the only flaw is that he takes a lot of damage. So you have to be very careful about it. There is power gener there is power steel effect. Right, and he's dead. Shazam will increase the damage for Raiden. Alright. This is a 
difficult team to be honest we can still uh you know take down that barrier because there is twin blade oh no okay all right that flash was strong as hell yeah there is nothing much we can do over here because we've already died once so region matrix is gone one hit with dark side there we go one special with dark side all right we're gonna take a look and add another fight okay so you know i think this team is one of those teams just like the loa team which can help you to finish off fights in a matter of seconds okay he's gonna revive back and just a touch and he's dead all right guys so these are a few teams that i actually love to play with and uh you know, I, I think if you have these characters, you should put it to good use. You 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 may not have all of these characters, but try to uh, use them in arena. And uh, believe me, once you once you are at that position or at that level where you have these characters, arena will be like a piece of cake for you. You know, just like it is. It's not that high uh, skill or anything in arena. You just have to swipe back, let the opponent jump, and swipe right. So it's not it's not that skill that many skill required in the arena to be honest. Uh, but you compare to raids and solo raids and other places, so yeah, you know, try to build these te build these te these teams. Uh, you know, if you're looking to get some good characters or good teams for arena, and these are my favorites. All right, guys, so thank you for your time. Uh, you guys have a great day and good luck. Bye bye.